In this section, we are going to talk about mixers. An RF mixer is a three-point passive or active device that can modulate or demodulate a signal. When we say modulation, it means that we want to uh, move our signal from a low or intermediate frequency to a high frequency. So let's say from low frequency to a high frequency. This is called modulation and it's a frequency shift. And uh, the demodulation is exactly the opposite of that. So we move our signal from a high frequency to an intermediate or low frequency. The purpose is to change the frequency of electromagnetic signal while preserving every other characteristic such as the phase and amplitude of the initial signal. So basically here it says that uh, we want to save our data, you know, we want to save our data and uh, we just want to change the frequency, we just want to, you know, increase our speed. So mi mixer here uh, is doing the thing that we want, is doing the modulation for us. Here we can see modulation and demodulation. The up conversion is like modulation. So imagine we have a signal here and it has an intermediate frequency. It's not, intermediate frequency is not very low. So, but compared to the high radio frequency, it's a low frequency. We mix our intermediate frequency with a local oscillator. Local oscillator produce as a carrier. We call this carrier, if you remember. And the carrier has a high frequency. It's FLO. And uh, we have a F intermediate here. So when we mix these two signals, the output signal, uh, we actually, if you see here, we will explain it, don't worry about that. We have two, uh, you know, signals here that are moved. So this signal, after mixing, you know, it goes to the high frequency and it has two components here. This is called up conversion. And uh, the first component here has a frequency of FLO plus FIF. So this is our low frequency, data frequency, or intermediate frequency, let's say. And this is our carrier frequency. And also, we have a second data here, which is FLO, sorry, which is FLO minus F minus FIF. And we have down conversion. Down conversion is exactly opposite of that. So we want to uh, return back our signal from high frequency to IF. Some people will say that why we need that. Imagine we have to do process on in our data and we get our we captured our data. But the thing is that this frequency is so high, we we can uh, we can't make filters or lots of analog circuit that uh, that can work in this high frequency. It's high frequency, so we must move our data to low frequency, and uh, th this is called down conversion. And we can do, you know, process in our data, process on our data in an intermediate frequency. We can do filtering, shaping, whatever we want. But we can't make a really efficient analog device in this analog, actually, let's say, uh, you know, block in this high frequency. And uh, the down conversion is done by mixer again. So we have, if we have radio frequency and if we multiply it again by the same local oscillator, you will get an intermediate frequency again. Thank you for watching our video. Please don't forget to subscribe. You can learn about this topic and more using our website. The complete course on this topic is provided on our website at www.rasoft.com. Rasoft is providing a complete certificate on radio frequency. The RF basic concepts and fundamentals course is provided free at our website. The courses are complete step-by-step -step approach with quiz and examples and certificate of completion will be provided upon finishing each course. By taking the required courses in RF system and IC design with pass status, RASOFT would provide the RASOFT Radio Frequency Certificate.
The topics are chosen with advice from RF engineers in top industry companies like Apple, Qualcomm, Broadcom and Skyworks who are missing candidates with these skills.